Hello, and welcome to day two of Redemption CO. Let's go. First things first, today we are moving out of the Airbnb and getting into the vans, which I'm actually kind of excited about. I've been in this Airbnb for like 10 days now. Goodbye, comfort. Goodbye, hot showers. Goodbye, reliable internet. gallon it's not the worst it's ever been today is an exciting day I'm both I'm both really excited but also kind of nervous because we are going to ride the newest uh, double black trail in the Denver Metro or like front range area it's called or shoot there's not a lot on the internet about it which is really kind of cool because I'm stoked to be able to put something out there that's that's uh, good footage for other people to see. Um, but I've been scouting and I've seen some videos and everything that I've seen, it looks legit. It looks serious. This place is kind of strange. You like driving through the mountain. I've been driving through the mountains for like an hour and then you just pop into this little area and there's just casinos everywhere. And this is the town of Blackhawk. Destination is on the right. Hidden Treasure Trailhead. I see Brian. <sighs> Howdy, partner. Hello, hello. Hey, I got a little, a little oh, present for you. Oh, I've been looking forward to this. Yeah. The sampler pack. Yeah, man. I'm so bad at, uh, like plugging myself and, and, and you know stuff from the channel but this is something that I'm really excited about and also super proud of. Yeah. yeah buddy. Oh you do me the honors yes. Not only do I have all new revamped my logo on the channel all of the artwork that I am very stoked about but in addition to that I have been working with Cognitive MTB to develop the first ever in the history of my channel, Sampler Riding Kit, which is just freaking awesome. And this will be the debut of it on the channel, which is sick. Especially that Brian's gonna be rocking it, man. Yeah, look at that. The Sampler. And I don't know if you can tell on, on camera, but do you see the uh, the light? Oh yeah. Live yeah. free, it says live free ride. Yeah, you can, I can on the camera. Oh man. Yeah, it fits you perfectly too, awesome. man. Yo, there's also, a, uh, a t-shirt in there for you. You know, you were giving me a hard time the other day about, <laughs> but I and, I, and I have mine of these too, so now I'll start wearing it now that it's debuted. So this is the brand new channel logo, which I am just so stoked on. One new shirt every six years. Every six years, baby. <laughs> Keeping those landfills hurting. <laughs> so we are on our way up for our first lap. I think we're gonna get two laps in today. First on a, trail called hard money and the second on the new ore shoot which is going to be pretty pretty serious in case i haven't shown it yet we got john here with us again he's behind me here on the trail john has ridden here one time before and he was the one that told us how serious ore shoot is and the reason i am like a little nervous about it is because I know that John's a super capable rider and he said he had to walk some of it. And I haven't seen that dude walk much of anything. Whoa! I like didn't have a back brake for a sec. Wait, what the f***? Dude, what is going on with my back brake? Nothing but problems today. <laughs> I, I squeezed it and it just went, went straight to the bar. Altitude sickness. Well, this climb is pretty nice. A-OK. -okay. A lot of switchbacks. We timed this all right. Look at this weather, bro. So perfect. Crazy. October, the, the secret season. Yeah. So now I think we wrap around the back of the mountain. Ah, get our first 
sights of the good old aspens. Yeah, they're hanging on. Gorgeous. In case Brian didn't mention it in his first video, by the way, and if you're newer to the channel, the way these series work, these road trips, these redemption road trips with Brian and I are that we take turns bouncing back and forth between each other's channel channels. So one video will be the first one was on Brian's channel and that will be live already if you haven't seen it. And the next one, this one is now on mine and then for the next adventure we'll jump back on to Brian's channel which is called BKXE if you haven't seen it yet. Ping pong. Is this our fourth redemption or third? I think unofficially it's four. Yeah. Because the first one we didn't call redemption. The first official redemption was redemption from that first failed <laughs> exactly. trip where I dislocated my shoulder right out the gate. Yeah. This is our lap number one, hard money, which it's a blue black it says. And John has written it, it says it's quite, quite Very dark. stout. Very dark. But, or shoot. Ah, up to the left there. So that's our second lap. It's used to be, be called powder keg. I wonder why they renamed it. Sick, we got downhill. <laughs> Hard money. I think Brian is gonna be very fast through here. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Yo, yeah, Brian. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, he's looking. Oh my goodness. Money, oh. money. Yo, Brian's looking great. <laughs> dude, nice drop, dude. Oh yeah, he's looking physical. I can always tell when he's on it, when he's feeling it. Holy moly, these turns are cool. But like not easy. So far, this is fantastic. A lot of cool options that make it worth riding a second time. Easy. Yeah. Ooh. Nice. Oh. oh, finally got me. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot of sand. <laughs> Damn, that's what it was. Nice, Brian. Dude, oh my God, he's riding so fast. This is the blue black? Yeah. What is Orshoot about to be like? Oh yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Yo, you are riding so fast, dude. <laughs> You're feeling it, I can oh, tell. The tech. Yeah, it was so good. That trail was rad, but bro, if that is just the blue black, what the hell do they call a double black, man? It is ah, whoo! We're gonna I got a feeling we're gonna be put to the test, dog. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, yo, if you guys liked that lap, make sure to go down and give this video a thumbs up. It's been a long time since I've asked for that. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, definitely go do that because I don't know how many episodes of Redemption CO we got in us, but there are more than just two. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and Brian's BKXC yeah. so you can follow along. Yeah. You're right, that was so fast. <laughs> Brian and I have our own little enclave here. Yeah. Privacy. Yeah. Hello. Pretty sweet. So we just took a little pit stop because it's just like right there when you drop out of that trail. Grab some lunch. I'm gonna hit the bathroom here and then we're gonna head up for the rowdiness. Oh. Oh. Alright, we have made it back up for round two, and this is the big kahuna that we have been looking forward to. Or shoot, extremely difficult, double black. 
warnings everywhere. This is an extremely challenging trail. The first feature is a reflection of the skill needed to ride this trail. Yeah, for those of you guys that are relatively new to mountain biking, this concept is called a squirrel catcher. And not that this, that they exist on a lot of trails. They often don't have a sign telling you that that's what it is, but it's kind of like a built-in piece of a trail. Good gosh. <laughs> How are we looking, Bri? I'm not, I'm not impressed. He ain't scared. <laughs> he ain't scared. I will eat those words later. <laughs> this is... Dude, what are you smoking? This is chunky as heck. For the record, I am scared. I, I yeah, know okay. there will be more. Saying not impressed was not the choice of words. I should have said, should have said I'm not scared. <laughs> I know what you meant. Yeah. You meant you're ready for it. Yeah, for that. You feel like it's well within your wheelhouse. Yes. That's exactly what you meant. And when I go over the bars, I'll be Everyone better. gets to say, I told you so. Yep. I'm gonna grab a couple gears here. Okay. <laughs> I ate my words. Holy moly, I actually got that. Nice, I was bouncing. My tire was eating my booty. That's super, super steep. I'm awake. <laughs> he made that look really good. A lot of front brake. Key on the steepness. Yeah, Bri. Holy cow. All good, all good, nice, nice. Perfect. Picking my head up, trying to. Control. <laughs> Full control. Wow, good job, bro. A lot of front brake. Yes. Good yeah. job. You got in there. Yeah. That was super scary right there because it's like, oh, I need to be. That is low. so steep. <laughs> this is what we call a no fall zone. Yeah. You can, there is not an option to fall while in this piece of trail. You, you will be at the hospital. <sighs> Getting up it is going to be a whole other ball game, dude. Oh. There's some weird, goofy alternate lines, I think, just from people doing ride arounds. And they're yeah. worn in like crazy, which is terrible. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah. you don't know what you're supposed to do. And then it's like having it just read the sign at the top. Yeah. <laughs> what Brian's saying is that if you're not up to the skill level, you shouldn't be on the trail. It's not safe for you. It's not good for the other people riding the trail. And I agree. Okay. You got this. Oh God. Yeah, gotta. Yeah. 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 Oh man. That is no joke. We might want to look at this because why not? I remember that this one in videos is that. Yeah, I remember people a like cliff. You don't have the balls for this. You what? <laughs> you don't have the balls for this. <laughs> what the? <laughs> what? And then, what? You have to get right there. Right here. Yeah. yeah. So you they, see how they chip that away? So you could come across in here. That's ridiculous. I think I'm okay with this. Me too. <laughs> God. Honestly, this scares me so much more. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they put the, the they put the concrete saw on this to Yeah, give this is the part I actually don't know about. This is what we're looking at. Jeez. 
<laughs> you gonna give it a go? Yeah. God. I know. No pressure, bro. Yeah. None. It's, it's really it's, not that bad, but it is. It's such a mind. It is. The ultimate. Let's see it again. Second run up. Yeah! Holy smokes! Humble! That looked awesome! Oh, it felt really good. Nice work. Thank you. Dude! Whew. That was gorgeous. Any words of advice? Um, you should probably stuff your chamois with some paper towels. <laughs> I got my dark pants on today. <laughs> I'd be lying if I wasn't a little nervous about this. Brian made it look real good that second run. Ooh, you're right. The left pedal feels like it's like real tight in there. It's so that's such a weird move. <sighs> Good news is I was so focused on this. I didn't even think about this. Yeah. This was a non-issue in the end. Let's go. That one is more about commitment than the difficulty of it, I'd say. I am pretty happy about that. Good work, dude. <laughs> How'd you like your line? He just literally just did it. He just dropped right in. He's an animal. There's no breaking once you get over the top. No, man. I saw you I saw you think about stopping yeah. and realize that you couldn't. Yeah. I think you're failing at right there too. Yep. That felt fine. That felt totally fine. You're a boss if you can get on this high line. That that's impressive that you actually you actually like you exited right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, I'm impressed. John, what line are you thinking? Maybe yours. It looks pretty good. Okay. Oh shoot, he's coming right at me. <laughs> You're an animal! You told me you were taking the other line! <laughs> nice control, man. Great braking right there. You look super that was nice. really good. I saw Brian do that. That was like, really okay, good. That didn't look too bad. That was great. There's that gap. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I just. Oh, man. I was over there like, I'm already pulling over. I can't pull over any further. <laughs> Whoa. We got a double black option here. Oh, no. I'll see you on the trail. I think that this would be totally fine if you get into this line and have some speed. I think I'll give her a go. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So the reason I gave this one a little extra consideration is because it's a, a downslope drop, you can't really stop. So once I'm in, I'm in. There's not going to be three run-ups on this one. It's I'm going or I'm not. And I'm going. I can picture it. If I can see it, I can do it. You good? Drop in. Yeah, that's 
gnarly. I smell victory. Oh, that run out ain't as easy as you think. I think I think I blacked out. I don't really remember dropping. <laughs> Hands down the most difficult, crazy thing I've done since back on the bike. Yeah. Hands down. Big old thing. Dude, holy moly. Good thing I didn't look at it from down here. I wouldn't have done this. How high is that? I think I landed right here. Yeah. So that's eight feet, seven, eight? Yeah, seven. But that made my day. Awesome. Bray, when you are, Bray, yeah, guy. I still don't think we've hit this one from the video that I keep remembering. I think we have. Oh, maybe this is it. You're good, I'm not behind you. Wow, what did he just go down? He's still going. Holy. I swear my back brake is locking up. Yo, well done, bro. That, that was, was, that was gnarly. Spicy. Take the spice. Hi. That, that, that was actually, in my opinion, one of the harder spots. Yeah. That second bit. Just came right up. Mm-hmm. Not out of the woods yet. I wouldn't have presumed. Oh my gosh. A lot of rocks, a lot of rocks. I am proceeding with caution. Because this is one of those trails that just clearly can, anything can be around the bend. Yeah. We are almost down, oh my God. I'm gonna stop here. This is the one. Yeah. Oh, there's a catch rope now. We're good. A what? Catch rope. Really? Oh, to climb back up probably. No, to catch you. To go over. Oh. Oh my God. Oh yeah, that's the that one I've way. been thinking about, yeah. I think we're fine. I think so too. Yeah. But it's very respectable. Wow. Ooh, from here. I know. God. I know. Wrap your bars around. Just make sure you go in real slow. Yeah. Don't tell me what to do. I'm good. All right. I'm gonna give you plenty of space, so don't worry. Awesome. Yeah! Oh. Now we can say we did. Man, the big bad monster of Colorado. Dude! I've never watched so many videos of a trail before. I, I did. know. <sighs> and and still not had a great idea. You have to see it to believe it. Yeah. That is one of those. Some may say one of the best trails. <sighs> what do you say? That was fantastic. I agree. That that lived that lived up to the hype for yeah. sure. And it's within our comfort zone, but pushing. That's why I think it's so incredible. It's hard to find that. It's right in that spot for us where yeah. it's very challenging, but we get the reward because we push ourselves and it was like, it was within our reach. Yeah. <sighs> All right, we have ungeared and my adrenaline is lowering and starting to feel. Hey, I'm good. Look how awesome this <laughs> shirt is. That's the, that's the casual shirt. Available at the Cognitive Store in the link below. Check it out. <laughs> John, thank you for coming out. And uh, even though you hadn't written everything, it was still good to have beta on like when stuff was coming up, man. And super stoked for you on that seat blind. That was, that was some serious control coming down. Dude, and I'll forgive you for almost <laughs> running over me. <laughs> Brian, man, hell of a ride, dude. You, you, were, you were riding so strong today, I think. The plan now is to go get some food and maybe make our way over all the way to Slida tonight. It's not that far actually, it's like two and a half, three hours, but food is calling. All right. 
We actually ended up heading over away from Blackhawk and into, I think it's called Idaho Springs. Cool little town here. They had a little bit more food options. The Tommy Knocker is a mythical subterranean gnome like creature. Oh, really? We've made it to Buena Vista, and now we are hunting down a parking spot. Oh, he's gonna... Too close, bro, too close. Get the... Get out of here. <laughs> Howdy, neighbor. Hey. <laughs> I'll just be over here. That's dope. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what a ride that was. I I am extremely excited about that ride. I think that was one of the more difficult, definitely the most difficult ride I've done since coming back off of my broken leg. Um, so that felt really good to get some, some stuff that I thought was difficult under my belt again. It was definitely a good boost for my, for my confidence. So, uh, hey, what was the end like? You, do, you, do you have your Strava? Do you know how far we did? Yeah. 11.6 miles in 20, what? 2,500. Wow, 2,500 feet of climbing, yeah, Brian's telling me over here. Uh, that's going to do it for the second episode here of Redemption CO. I hope you guys are enjoying the coming along for the journey. This sure as hell is, it, it's been a long time and man, it's just, it's like, no time has ever has passed at the same time. It's always such a good time to meet up with Brian and, and do these road trips. This is just, this is what it's all about. Like, I love it. Uh, so I hope you guys are loving it too. And next video is going to be over on Brian's channel, as I mentioned earlier in the video. So make sure to go check out BKXC so you guys can stay tuned for the rest of the Redemption CEO series. And uh, I will see you guys back here again for episode, let's see, next will be three. So I'll see you guys for episode four here on my channel. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for being here. We'll catch you next time. And until then, you know what to do. Live free, right? I don't know what I'm doing with my hands ever. <laughs> Live free, ride hard, and get, get stoked. stoked. We'll see you there. Good night, good sir. <laughs> <laughs>